Kilogram Series Quick Installation Video Chapter 1 Measure the Wiring Method of 10 to 120 Volts Battery First Step First disconnect the battery negative wire. Then screw it onto the copper screw with the load logo in the shunt. Second step. Make another wire to connect the negative pole of the battery and the copper screw with the bat mark in the shunt. The capacity of the connecting wire to withstand current is not lower than that of the negative wire of the primary battery. Third step. Then move the terminal on the back of the measurement module to 2W. Use the 4P cable to connect the shunt and the measurement module. The fourth step. Use a 1 to 2.5 um thin wire to connect the positive pole of the battery to the VSNS terminal on the upper right corner of the measurement module. The fifth step. Use the data cable to connect the measurement module in the display screen. The display screen is on. And the battery voltage is displayed normally. Note, if it is a battery pack composed of multiple batteries. The positive pole of the battery equals the total positive pole of the battery pack. And the negative pole of the battery equals the total negative pole of the battery pack. Chapter 2 Installation of Mobile App Both Android mobile phone users and iOS mobile phone users can scan the QR code through the browser to download. iOS mobile phone users can also search for Kilogram series in the Apple Store to download. Step 1 Scan the QR code on the measurement module to obtain the mobile app and install it successfully. Step 2 Turn on the Bluetooth of the mobile phone. Step 3 Turn on the phone location This is required by the Android system. We solemnly promise not to collect any location information. Step 4 Open the mobile phone app to search. Select the BTG-00X device and read the measurement information of the device. Chapter 3 Capacity Initialization Settings Both the mobile app and the display can complete the capacity initialization settings. Before the first use, you need to correctly set the effective capacity of the battery and the current remaining power percentage. If the effective capacity of the battery is unknown or the current remaining capacity is unknown, the following steps should be followed. A. Empty the power of the battery pack or put it until you don't want to discharge it. At this time, the power of the battery is zero by default. B. Enter the preset battery capacity setting in the system settings and set the capacity value as large as possible for example. Set the estimated 20 ampere hours to 30 ampere hours. C. Set the remaining capacity percentage to 0%. And then charge the battery pack. D. Check the remaining capacity value displayed on the display after fully charged. And set this value to the preset battery capacity. E. When discharging. The current color is blue. The remaining capacity value decreases and the battery percentage decreases. When charging, the current color is green. The remaining capacity value increases, and the battery percentage increases. Thanks for watching.